Hello, my name is Tianyi. I'm a product manager for Delta Sharing. Delta Sharing is developed by Databricks and the Linux Foundation to provide the first open source approach to sharing across data, analytics, and AI. In the next few minutes, I will show you how to easily and securely share AI models across clouds and regions using Delta Sharing. You can train your models in one place and deploy them anywhere. Delta Sharing also unlocks the full potential of collaboration with AI models, whether it's within your organization or with your external partners. To get started, I already have a sample AI model pre-trained and registered in my Databricks Unity catalog. This model forecasts the daily power output of a wind farm based on weather data. Now, to deploy this model to production and serve inference queries, I want to minimize the network latency and provide the best experience. This means I will co-locate it to the same cloud and region as my end users and applications. In this case, my model had been trained and persisted in AWS US West 2, but my target user is on Microsoft Azure West US. So I'm going to share my model to that cloud and region and serve from there. Here you can see I'm already in the home workspace for the trained model. So the next thing I will do is to navigate to the Delta Sharing UI. And then by clicking on the Share Data button, I can create a new share. And let me give it a name. And the next thing is to add the model to the share. So here in this Asset Selection UI, let me search for the model. And I can either add the model itself or add the entire schema. Now that I have added the model to the share, the next thing I need to do is to share it to the target region. And how I would do that is to add a new recipient to the share. So I'll give a name to this recipient. And the next thing I need is a sharing identifier. So I already have the workspace and Unity catalog pre-provisioned. So let me grab that sharing identifier from there. All right, you can see I have successfully added the recipient and also the model to the share. So the sharing has been completed. Let me switch to the recipient side and deploy the model to the target region. So here I'm at the Delta Sharing uh, provider page. And you can see if I sort the providers by date, uh, there's a new provider just created. And clicking into it, I can see there's a new share that I can mount locally. So let me just reuse the name. All right, it's been mounted in my local uh, Unity catalog. And if I find the model itself, I can actually just serve from here. Here in this model serving page, uh, let me also give it a name. And then uh, I just need to pick the right version for the model and also the compute type for the model, uh, as well as uh, the compute capacity. Then I can create the model serving endpoint. All right, you can see this model serving endpoint is being created right now. With this demo, we've reviewed how to share a pre-trained model and set it up based on your end user and application needs. As you can see, Delta Sharing can now easily share and serve AI models securely within your organization or across clouds, platforms, and regions.